how serious are you about this scale from zero to 10? 10 being, this is something you really, 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 really want to do. Zero being, I'm just, I, I don't know. I'm just kind of trying something. No, this is something that I really want to do. Okay. Here's now what I advise you. You have a really cool voice. Your voice can definitely be used in TV and film. You need to get around some good producers. You need to get around people who know how to do this stuff. Because this track that you just played me right now, this sounds very, very beginning. It's played well, but it's not competitive with what's going to be out there. So if this is the final track, then it doesn't matter how cool your voice is. It's not going to be competitive with mainstream what's going out in TV and film. So what I would recommend to you is only if you're serious, is I would say, you need to be around people who are also really good at doing this at a high level because you have a really cool voice. You got this thing that stands out, but then the track and everything around it is kind of like, man, it's okay. So what I'd recommend is if your voice stands out, get around producers that stand out and who know how to do this already, who already know how to do sync at a high level. That way, when you come together, the music really stands out and it's able to to be competitive and shocking and oh this is great so i think you have one part of the puzzle which is your voice and if you wrote the song i think it's really cool concept too the game has changed that i can see that concept in sync but i think the overall track and a mix and a really good sound is really what's important i know before you said you had like three songs in the batch the important thing to know is that in order to really get into sync to where you can make money doing it you most likely have to do it between 30 to 50 songs. That's the sweet spot. If you're doing below that, then you're just kind of hoping things might happen one day. And if they do, great, but you don't really know. You have no real leverage. You're not really sure what's going on. And you might put into a company's licensing library and they might sit on it for four years because they have 100,000 songs in their catalog. So if you're trying to do this seriously, the people who are successful in this usually have a minimum of 30 to 50 songs and then you see their career start to be sustainable and then they usually just keep making more songs and more songs and more songs because now they're sustainable i can tell you're still building your brand so i would say if that's what you're serious about then that'd be the the big part that i would just advise you on if i can give you any advice it's get around people who have the ears for what's competitive for today on radio but like knows how to make a sound with your voice that sounds competitive with what you would hear on the top hundred of billboard charts. And if you can do that, that's the best information I can give you because your voice sounds really cool.